Hi, guys. What's going on? Welcome back to the show. It's Beaker's Lab. The gang is back. You guys know what it is. Hey, man, I'm your host, Beaker. We got my bunnies, Melly and Pi up there. Pi, just looking so chill. By the way, guys, it was just Easter weekend, so I went and saw my, you know, human family. But for my bunny family, I got them a bunch of presents. It was like Christmas, you know? I guess it's Christmas for bunnies, you could say. Cool. Anyway, beyond all that, guys, we're, we're back to reality now. We're back to normal you know, midweek stuff. And I'm trying to do a little tour, go to all of our bases, right? We got like six or seven bases, some of which I haven't been on in, in ages. This was the one that we lost forever. This is our lost base, Beaker 08. And, but you know what I love about this base now? It's the one that we don't have a dark storage. Look, like we got, you know, we got a max king, level five king, pretty good king, but no dark storage. The only dark elixir we can hold, 2,500. Not really enough to do anything. I mean, it's, it's legitimately not enough to do anything. Now, I figured at first we were going to have to build it eventually, right? Like, how far can you really go in the game without building a dark storage? But again, once you get the Tunnel 7, they just put the king in the shop. Instead of doing all the work, you can just give them... It was like five bucks in the shop just give you a max king. I mean, it was kind of shocking. Like, I'm, I'm still pretty shocked that, that was in there. Guys, my other favorite dark elixir troop or offense thing in the game, it's Hoggos. Guys, I really want to do hogs, and we don't have enough storage to even do it. You know how we could do hogs, guys? I have figured out, and I think you guys, some of you guys probably know what I'm talking about. I've figured out how we can get 5,000 Dark Elixir for that. It's, it's possible. It's going to take a little while, but it's possible. But guys, like, before we get to that, we can get good hog riders in the clan castle already. We can bring level one hog riders. I think you guys know what we got to do. Get your shades on. Get your shoes off. I also, yeah, we definitely need to do the minions. We got to do the minions. Okay, you guys ready? In three, two, one, peace. Eight hours, eight hours, cool. It's been a while since I've seen an upgrade that takes eight hours, very good. So this has got me thinking, man, how far could you get? Not very far. Like, how, could you get to Tunnel 8 without a dark storage? Yeah, I mean, you're just gonna be missing out on a lot of things. Well, you're never gonna be able to get the queen, right? I mean, that's Tunnel 9, but you know what I mean? Unless, when you get to Tunnel 9, some of you guys might know this. When you get to Tunnel 9, do they do the same thing? Do they put the queen in the shop and they're like, hey, do you want to buy the queen with money? I bet they do. Could you get every hero in the game without ever getting a dark search? 900 dark elixir is pretty huge when you can only hold 2,500. Do you guys want to take this? I'm actually kind of worried about that level four king. I know that ours is level five, but like our entire army is a level five king. We ain't got much else. He's he's the general. He's the, he's everything. You guys ready for a king fight? Let's do it up. Here we go. Let me check for trappos. Nothing. I love it. I love it. Here we go. Uh, yeah. Sorry, buddy. I have healers. You don't. So let me get a wall bigger in there. Open that up. Perfect, dude. That's exactly what I wanted. Great. All right, perfect. So we are now going to go into the base. I do want to take out that air defense right there. Hmm. How am I going to do that? I'll start here. Wait, he's getting... Come on. Come on. Go right there. Now we're talking. Spam and go. Let's do this thing. <laughs> okay, which ones are the level one hoggos? They look really plain, right? So the level fours. Oh, they have the better. They they have the different mohawk. They have the red mohawk. The level ones are just like plain hoggos, right? They they don't have. Hogs are so overpowered at this level. Are you kidding me? Like, like... all right. Well, there's definitely going to be some bombs in there. All right. I thought there were going to be bombs in there. I was pretty sure. Anyway, let's hit the king ability. He's still up. That's why this is going to be good for us. Because if the king doesn't die, he's ready to go in the next one immediately. He's our biggest asset. We're never... I think we can do this, man. I think we get this base to Tunnel 9. And if they have that thing in the shop... Do you think we can be free to play except heroes? We buy the heroes whenever we get to the new town hall. If it's in the shop, if there's a pack that's like, hey, buy this hero, we'll give you a level five hero. I think they do that at town hall seven, town hall nine. 
And they probably do it at all the other town halls when you get the warden and when you get the champion. I'm pretty sure I remember that. So you could end up with no dark storage, but four level five heroes. Guys, I just remembered something so stupid. I, I understand why they did this, but you know they have that thing, you can't upgrade your town hall until you've built everything, right? We're gonna have to build the dark storage. So it's gonna end up being how far can you get in the game with a level one dark storage, right? For now, it's no dark storage. Cause I think we can get, I'm pretty sure we can do everything in town hall seven. Cause I don't think, like how many times can you upgrade hog riders? How many times can you upgrade minions at this level? Once probably, right? Maybe twice, but even, even so, if that's the case, we're gonna do this guys. We're gonna do this. And when we absolutely have to build a level one dark storage, that's it. We're gonna keep a level one. And I bet you could get to Tunnel 15. Your base isn't gonna be good, but you could get there. You could get every single hero just by buying them in the shop. All right, guys, so we gotta go do one more raid because we need the full gold, the full elixir, and I bet we can do every one of these. You know what I'm gonna say? We are gonna do every one of these walls in one click. I, I guarantee it. How much do they cost? 50K. We got a lot of 50Ks. <laughs> we got 50Ks for days. Okay, let's go. Let's do it, man. Let's spam everything in one single spot, though. There's something about that I've always loved, right? And yeah, sometimes your troops are gonna go around the outside. Maybe we can, maybe we can keep that from happening. But otherwise, I just love rush. Just especially at these lower levels, just rush into the base. All right, what can we do to clear the corners? All right, let's say right here. All right, man, we're gonna do. One balloon. I don't think there's air traps. Do they have air traps at this level? No, I don't think so. I can't even think straight. You must have some sort of air traps at this level. I, I just can't remember. King, I really thought you were going to go the other way. I'm okay with it. Do your thing. Balloons are so good at this level too. Oh my goodness. All right, so we got to get the wall in there and we got to get, uh, well, something over here. Here we go. Keep going, keep going guys. Wait, why didn't the healers follow the hogs? I dropped a couple of, it's fine. They, they stuck in the king, it's fine. So I don't think we even need a heal spell here. I'm really, oh, the king went back. I love when the king follows hogs around or balloons, you know, the queen can follow balloons around sometimes. And then once the hogs or the balloons get done with the defenses, they turn on the hero and just, yeah, I kind of wish we had just seen that. We got a hero fight though. Wait, the, oh yeah, they're going for the dark elixir. I was like, why aren't the goblins helping? No, it's cool. You got it, buddy. Dunk! I love how he actually does have a punch, right? He can hit with a sword, he can punch. It's kind of random, right? Yeah, it seems random. He just does one, then the other. Oh, no, it's truly random. It's fine. Do your thing, buddy. Do your thing. Anyway, we got the Dark Elixir in there. We got a little bit more here uh, for cleanup troops. I even have a spell. But let me just hit the king ability. We got it. We got it. Peace. And give me that dark. Give me that dark. Perfect, dude. Look at the dark elixir bar up at the top. You could see it. Like normally one raid doesn't make the bar go like significantly up. It does when your bar is only 2,500. <laughs> Yikes. Anyway, look, guys, we got full loot. We have 4 million gold, 4 million elixir. At this level, that's a lot. We actually have far more than that. <laughs> You guys already know. It's the main event. All right, man. Welcome back to the main event. Show within a show where we do something stupid. I'm your host, Beaker. Okay, so if you guys are familiar with Beaker's Lab, you know what a sleeve of walls is. It is a sleeve of walls is 44 walls. The most you can do, right? We could almost do... We could do like 80 walls with this amount of gold. So yeah, we can pretty much do every single one. That's going to be a bit of a bummer because... What are we going to spend extra gold and elixir on? I guess nothing. It's fine. In three, two, one. All right, man. That's it. Anyway, we love you guys. We will see you next time right here on the one and only Beakers Lab.